Hi and welcome today to a new tutorial on TradingShenzhen.com. I would like to show you today how to install a global firmware on a Xiaomi device. Doesn't matter if it's a Xiaomi 13 Ultra, a 12S Ultra or a 11 Ultra, any Xiaomi device. We got any tutorials in English and German on our site on the how to section. There you find for example also the Xiaomi U fastboot and touch recovery tutorials. But the most important part for us right now for the global tutorial is that the device has to be unlocked. You find also a tutorial for how to unlock a device and you will know that your device is unlocked when you start your device and at the top of the device you will see a small lock symbol which is open. Now you are perfectly prepared to install a global firmware. You need just two tools to do it. The first tool is the Xiaomi Mi Flash tool which you will find on xiaomiflashtool.com. You download just the latest version here, the 2022 version and we need the firmware which you will find on xiaomifirmwareupdater.com. The first thing, just click on scroll to downloads and enter your Xiaomi device. For example, here in our case, we do it with the 13 Ultra. So we enter Xiaomi 13 Ultra. Click on download and then you see a list with all the firmwares which are right now available for the device. For us right now, the global is the most important one and you see it two times. Once it's a recovery version and once is the fast boot version. We need the fast boot version. So you click on the download, but it doesn't matter. Both are shown and this is really important. Usually first is the recovery version shown. You see it as the type recovery and as a smaller file size. And the second one is the fast boot, which is usually way, way bigger. Just download the zip file and then you got both zip file extracted. Use for example, WinRAR on a Windows PC. And then you go into the Mi Flash tool folder. Do you a favor and the first thing you have to create is a folder which is called lock because sometimes it gives some problems with the Mi Flash tool. When you created the lock folder, click on show me flash and it will open up a new pop-up which is showing you all the drivers you need. Just click on install, then usually the app shuts down. Just open it again and all the files you needed, all the driver files you needed are installed. The first and most important part is to click here down on clean all. Because you're having right now a Chinese device which you're installing in global firmware and usually preset is clean all and lock. And when you lock the device after it, it will break. So the first and most important part is to click on clean on. Without this, you shouldn't flash. When you have clicked on clean all, we have to select the firmware version. So click on the top on select and search for the firmware version on your PC. Usually it's in the downloads folder and then you click on the firmware folder and you see that you are on the right place and you have to select the right one when the images folder is below it. Then just click on OK and now you can start to flashing it. So you have to put your device into fast boot mode. Just press the power button and the volume button down as long as 10 seconds and you will see on the display a fast boot symbol. Now plug in your USB cable and you will hear the usual window sound that the USB device is recognized. Click on refresh and you can start to flash the firmware. Finally, the process will take around 10 minutes to flash the whole firmware on the device. The most important part is don't unplug the USB cable during this process and in the end the result will show you a success or in the later latest versions even an error but this isn't a problem the device will reboot and you will have the official and latest Xiaomi global firmware on your device this firmware on the end is the official global firmware you will get all the over the air updates which the official global also get and everything works except one thing safety net will fail and this means that google pay won't work on this device all the other stuff and also banking apps should work without any problems if you want to have everything worked i recommend an xiaomi u firmware which also is pretty easy to install this was the global firmware tutorial. I hope you liked it. If you have any question, just put it down into the comments. And if you liked it, just give us a thumbs up. Your Trading Shenzhen team.